It's a great day for hockey cards, and today we're going to take a look at 2016-17 Fleer Showcase. But before we do that, just want to remind you of our new contest. Uh, we have three prizes we're giving away. We're giving away two of these lots of cards. Each one contains over $140 worth of stuff, Beckett High Value. Uh, each one also contains at least two hits. It's all rookies, stars, serial numbered, parallel cards, good stuff. And the main prize we're giving away is this box of 2019-20 Upper Deck Ice Hockey. So if you want to win any of these prizes, check out the details in the description below. And then win. So let's get right into 1617 Fleer Showcase. We're getting five cards per pack, eight. 18 packs per box. Remember the days of all those packs. Fleer Showcase doesn't exist anymore. Uh, this was the actually the last year for the product. Um, just kind of sad because I, I liked the last three years that this product existed. Uh, it, was a, it was a pretty good break. It's one of those that sits in between the, you know, ultra premium or the, the premium one pack jobs and the sets like you know mvp where they're a little bit lower end you know and you got stuff like stature which just came out which is a one pack job that's 100 bucks and this kind of fit right in the middle of that you get a lot of cards you get a lot of variety to it which i like and at the end of the day it's a pretty fun break this has become a little bit harder to find um i forget what i paid for this i've actually had this box for a little bit now because I tend to... It's already broke. Didn't think I cut through the seal, but I did. Uh, so let's break into it. Obviously, 2016-17, we're looking for Mitch Marner. We're looking for Patrick Laine. We're looking for Austin Matthews. Matthew Barzal. There's, there's a bunch of good rookies for this year. And hopefully, we'll hit some. We should also get at least one autograph out of this box. And hopefully that is a good one as well. So let's take a real quick look at the base cards. We've got Braden Holpe there. So basically it's the player with like a gold background imposed over, you know, you can still see bits of the picture, but they've covered it with gold. Um, nice, plain, easy to read, white on black. I know that uh, one of the problems with ice, which I'm giving away a box, did you hear? Uh, one of the problems with ice was that in some areas it was really hard to read the players names because they use white lettering on light blue uh, which makes it difficult so there we have it there's what the base card looks like so then we've got sean monahan and we've immediately got a die cut we've got a hot gloves of carrie price so that's neat i don't ever think i've actually pulled one of these hot gloves inserts we've got our decoy and we've got nazim kadri and dustin bufflin which is good because I'm running out of decoys. So this product is one where every single pack has a decoy because they're trying to hide the patch autos from you, which you can also get in this product. We've got Stammer. We've got Vasilevsky. And here we go. We've got a Fleer Flare Showcase Rookies of Austin Matthews. So this is not his quote-unquote true rookie card, but it is a Austin Matthews rookie year card Connor McDavid and Andre Kopitar so I don't know if this product just wasn't a good seller for Upper Deck or what the deal was why they got rid of it uh, I probably bought at least a case of this in 1617 Matt Zuccarello Nicholas Backstrom and we've got a Skybox Prospects of Pavel Buchnevich 459 of 499. So there are a lot of weird kind of rookie variants in here. Not that that's weird, but Ryan Johansson and Andre Palat. Got Johnny Goudreau, Louis Erickson, and we've got a right wing. Right wing. We've got a, he is a right wing, but we've got a metal universe, Connor Brown. Also Connor Brown's rookie year. Carey Price, 
and Derek Stepan. Corey Crawford, Andrew Ladd. I guess our insert's going to stick on everyone. And a red glow of Marion Hosa. So this has become pretty commonplace in all Upper Deck products where there's just basically a parallel of the base set. And that's what these red glows are. Jordan Eberle and Evgeny Kuznetsov. Marion Hosa, TJ Oshi, and we've got an Alex Ovechkin flare showcase. I always thought the numbering was interesting on these. It's a row and a seat number. Kind of like a, a ticket for the game. Vladimir Tarasenko and Gino. Kevin Shattenkirk. Jonathan Taves. Looks like we've got another Metal Universe. We've got a Dylan Larkin. Metal Universe. Robbie Fabry and Pekka Rinne. We've got Leon Dreisaitl, Max Pacioretty, and something shiny here. We've got another flare showcase of Jimmy VC. And this was Jimmy VC's rookie year. Pretty highly touted signing out of college. Uh, he hasn't made much of his career yet. I think he's with Buffalo right now, so hopefully he can turn it around. Jonathan Drouin and Shane Gustaspare. I remember his rookies were fairly high sought after in 1617. John Tower. <laughs> John Tuva, John, Jonathan Tavares, Mark Stone, and of course our insert is stuck to Mark Stone, and it is a red glow of T.J. Oshi, Tevu Teravainen, and Ryan Getzloff. Patrick Hornquist. Yarmir Yager, and we've got a Metal Universe Red, or I think they call these Rubies, William Nylander. Also William Nylander's rookie year, and this one is 150 of 150. So last of the run, or at least the last one stamped. Rick Nash and Henrik Sedin. We got Seth Jones, Brendan Gallagher, and we've got a scoring kings of Mario Lemieux. I think I may have this one already, but those are really cool. If you remember the old Skybox uh, basketball cards, they kind of did this sort of thing where they would do like a weird background, but uh, that's really, that is a really cool looking card. 66 there. Joe Pavelski. And Claude Giroux. Getting down near the bottom. Haven't pulled our auto yet. We've got Taylor Hall, Tyler Sagan, and we've got a Metal Universe of Shea Weber. And we've got Corey Schneider and Alexander Barkov. Final six packs. Jack Eichel. Oh, just spoiled it. Mike Hoffman. And we've got a hot prospect auto, Josh Morrissey, numbered to 499 of the Winnipeg Jets. Not an Austin Matthews, but uh, we'll take it. He doesn't have a bad signature there. These are sticker autos on these cards. As you can kind of see the holographic foil off the sticker so we got josh morrissey there is a slight chance you can pull two autos out of one of these but i've never seen it or i've never done it i've seen it done shea weber and james van reemstuk artemi panarin 
Patrick Kane, John Tavares, Red Glow, Nikita Kucherov, and Logan Couture. Some people call this one of the best rookie classes in NHL history. I think it's too soon to uh, to make that determination. A lot of them are only you know four years into their NHL careers, and some of them aren't even established yet. Brendan Saad, Mark Giordano, and there's a Mitch Marner. This is a rookie year card, Middle Universe. Jeff Skinner and Gustav Nyquist. Down to the final three packs. What will they contain? The obvious answer, hockey cards. Brad Marchand, Franz Nielsen, and we've got a Johnny Hockey. Flare Showcase. Looks kind of confused there, but that's okay. We'll let slide. Fill the Thrill and Ovi. So I get it's been amazingly hot in uh, in Pittsburgh the last couple of days. And just as an aside here, when I record, I turn off the air conditioner in this room so that you don't hear the air conditioner running in the background, because. Uh, Background noises drive me crazy when I'm listening to a video and the and the focus of the audio isn't the person speaking or the action going on. So I turned it off. It's only been off at this point for maybe 14 minutes and I am I'm dying. <laughs> I'm sweating. I am wow, I just can't believe how quickly just this one room heated up. Uh Jerome McGinley, OEL, and we've got a hot prospect of Alan Quinn, I think. 290 or 399. Daniel Sedin and Ryan Suter. Last pack. Let's see what we can draw out of here. We've got Matt Duchesne. Oh, and we've got an EX. Pavel Zaka. So these are like acetate cardboard mixed cards. And it's a little, it's a. Uh, Picture's printed on the acetate, so that's why it's in reverse on the back side. And it's just kind of see-through with the shiny hollow. I think I have a couple of Ryan Getz laughs of this. Never pulled anyone great. But that would be cool. We've got a Sidney Crosby and an Eric Carlson to finish it off. So that's it. That is 2016-17 Fleer Showcase Hockey. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you like the channel, hit that subscribe button. You have to be subscribed to win that contest I mentioned earlier, so just go ahead and hit it now. But thanks for watching, and we will see you next time.